by enriching the land humans are impoverishing the sea nutrients in the form of synthetic fertilizers containing nitrogen and phosphorus when added to agricultural land can leach into rivers and ultimately the sea other sources of these include human sewage and farm animal manure these nutrients can cause an explosion of plant and algal life that disturbs delicate marine ecosystems this process is called cultural eutrophication and it can have serious consequences for marine life the threats posed by eutrophication include reduced water clarity oxygen depletion and toxic algal events that result in critical habitat loss such as coral reefs sea grass meadows and mangrove forests other serious consequences include mass mortalities of marine animals loss of biodiversity and ultimately threats to human health conservative estimates indicate that there are now over 700 dead zones within the ocean where eutrophication has caused significant oxygen depletion resulting in mass mortalities of marine animals while eutrophication is bad in isolation other human activities such as overfishing and burning fossil fuels can compound its effects even further for instance climate change increases river runoff and consequently the level of nutrient pollution too overfishing affects animals that typically eat algae allowing algal bloom to grow larger some of the steps that can be taken to reduce nutrient pollution include restoring habitats such as mangroves and marshes that can remove nutrients from water before they reach the sea as well as managing and reusing wastewater